are you relieved that you can actually concentrate on a game of rugby and not on a circus? Um, look, I must say we we fortunate in in terms of the 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 support and the the, the, the legal team and everybody that worked behind the scenes. I mean, we were very shielded from it, to be honest. Uh, and where we stay on the Gulf Estate over here, we we almost in our own little bubble. So for us, it was business as usual, and we just focused on on rugby, uh, and, and that was taken care of in the background. Remember the 95 final, and or have you watched it recently? Yes, I remember it very well. Uh, um, patches, I was a student, so... Uh, <laughs> I was probably a couple couple of beers strong. No, I was definitely. Uh, but I remember I remember running in this uh, after the, the the victory. We were all we were all in the in in the streets uh, in South Africa in Bloemfontein. I was like I was a uni back then. Uh, when we came back to 2018, the point there is, you actually don't know the future, um, and and that's how I see it. I'm not I'm not emotional because I don't know if it's if this is my last test match for the box or not uh, um, because. You can plan life as much as you want, but life has got its own way, and destiny has got its own way. So for me, I just focused on, I think, how you should approach the game. This is your, the, every day, any day can be your last day with a, with, with a team. I, enjoy, I just enjoyed every single minute of it, uh, and, and just stay in the now, in the moment, and, uh, and just uh, uh, enjoy the players, because I think this group, like CRC, this will probably never, no, not probably, this will never happen in our lifetime again. So, so rather thinking of maybe this might be the end, or it is the end, or not, just stay in the moment and just enjoy for what it is. It's probably the biggest occasion that we will ever be part of and probably the biggest rugby game that there's ever been. One and two playing each other in a World Cup final uh, uh, and whoever wins is going to be the first team to win, or country to win four, four World Cups. So it's, it's massive. It's all to gain. So that was my approach. I just, I just stayed in the moment because I have been uh, in, twice I've been in positions where I thought this is, my, this is the end. As I will never be here again, and and look where we are, where we are now. Yeah, so that's how I approached it. What does it mean personally to you to play a World Cup final against the All Blacks? Well, we, we actually spoke about it uh, yesterday. Um, um, yeah, it's it's huge. It's always big playing against the All Blacks, but to play it in the World Cup final when it's number one and two team in the world playing um, head to head, it's. Yeah, I don't think it's stuff that you can dream about because it doesn't happen often. I don't think it will happen in our lifetime again to have two teams like this. And um, yeah, we've prepared as hard as we can and we 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 know uh, what to expect. Obviously, there might have some new things coming, but like I think for a player to be playing in a game like this, I don't think will ever it will ever get any bigger. So we we we're excited, we're looking forward to it. We know how good they are and how good they've been. You know, they they, you know, a couple of months ago, they were going through a tough patch, and that's how good of a team they are. That's how proud of they are of the team. They just turned it around quietly behind the behind the scenes. They were doing their work, and and now and now they're here. So I'm looking forward to it. And we've had to work, uh, find our way too, you know. And the way that the coaches went the last year or so, they mean we've played over maybe 50 players to try and find the best. Even the guys that are not here, I think they will be prepared to come and fill in this day. So I'm looking forward to, to, to Saturday. I don't think it will ever be, uh, get bigger than this. It will probably be the biggest game of my life. And Jacques, can I explain abuse? I just wonder what you make of that, how that makes you feel. Um, yeah, it's definitely, especially for me, it's, if it's a player, if it's a coach, if it's a referee, um, I obviously don't support that and I obviously feel for him and um, I have spoken to him. Um, I've spoken to him, I sent him a message as soon as I saw that's going on because it's somebody that I respect, that I've played with uh, against uh, for, 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 for quite a while and I've, I've been through it too. I've been through it too. When we can take it as players, when it comes to us directly, it's fine but when it comes to your family, it's totally different and that's exactly what he said uh, uh, to, uh, to me, that it's um, it's really hard when you, the people when they uh, when the family is involved. So yeah, I, it's it's the one part of the game that we really don't enjoy. You know, we don't mind being criticized about how we play on the field and everything like that. You know, and but when it comes personal and you know we've experienced it too. Kobo's family experienced it. He, they yeah. got death threats. You know, so 
we've been there, and as a rugby family, as much as we compete, we definitely do support each other when things like this, like it doesn't matter whether you're opposition or not. So I feel for him and I feel for his family, and I hope, you know, obviously it stops, and I hope he was able to, to, to prepare as much as he could for the game that he's playing tomorrow. So, I, uh, yeah, I've, I've, I've let him know um, that we are supporting him and that we're thinking of him. I can't say anything better. I fully agree with you. I was funny enough just thinking of that question um, before you asked it. Uh, and I don't know really why, um, but I think it, it, for me personally, doesn't get bigger than this. Um, if you look what's at stake and uh, getting the fourth title, going back to back, yeah, it, it, yeah I don't really, I can't really answer that, um, to be perfectly honest. Um, it's probably just the feeling that you have inside and, and I think you all can feel it, and I think people and supporters can feel it. Um, it's special and, and very privileged to be, to be just in this situation. There's not a lot of people that are going to come after us and, and have this feeling and have this situation to be in. Um, so, yeah, I think it's, yeah, it's spectacular. I, I, I'm looking forward, to, looking forward to it so much. Um, and like I said, that there's a lot more to play for than, than just that cup. We, we're doing it for a lot, of, a lot of different reasons. But uh, going up against this side in a final, trying to go back to back, it's, um, it's pretty special. I, I can't explain it. It's more a feeling. And um, I think you're going to see some unbelievable rugby on the weekend. You know, as if I've said, we're really excited. Just on Chesa. Is it birthday today? Yes, yes sir. Saturday. 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 Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, I guess that's a, a nice present to give him then, um, to get the win. Uh, he's, a, he's a great guy. We've, we've been mates for, for quite a bit and um, sort of had a similar thing where he, going through our career where he's always, people in the past said he's too small to, to play this game. Um, but I think he quickly showed that's, that's not the case. He's an unbelievable player, unbelievable guy, works unbelievably hard and um, doesn't have a, a doubt in, in his ability at all. He'll, he'll take on anyone, anywhere, any place, uh, and he'll probably come out on top. Um, quite enjoy him training at nine, seeing that he can actually become a bit tired, not just hanging out on the wing. So it's good to see that, that side of it. Um, but uh, he's, uh, he's an unbelievable guy for us um, as, a, as a friend and as a player. You always, I think everybody feels when he gets that ball, something special is going to happen, and, and more often than not, it does. So we're very lucky to have him on our side.